promotions. In two weeks, at the WWE Network pay-per-view, Elimination Chamber, Ronda Rousey will be signing her Monday Night Raw contract. Now the other news is, last Monday night when Raw went off the air, my son Jason Jordan and I went to a local medical facility where Jason had an MRI done to his neck. Jason was told he had to have, he'd have to have neck surgery. He had the surgery the following day, and he will be out of commission, and unfortunately, he will miss WrestleMania. Calm, cool, and collect with a smile on my face. But I can't do it anymore. Uh -oh. I'm going to talk to you tonight, not as the GM, but as a father. If any of you get any kind of joy out of seeing a WWE superstar get injured and miss WrestleMania, then you should be ashamed of yourself. I know Jason Jordan might not be your favorite WWE superstar, but he is a human being, and he is my son. And all I want is for you to wish him, get better wishes on his return, that's all. Now whether you agree with me or not, that's up to you. I'm just saying it would be very respectful if you did that. Good kid, and he's in a tough spot. You know? I, hey, I should know. I, I've been there. A few years ago, uh, I was the WWE champion. Matter of fact, I won the title a few miles up the street at Levi Stadium. Yeah. Cashed in my money in the bank contract, beat Roman Reigns, beat Brock Lesnar, and shocked the world. And I was unstoppable. I was on cloud nine. I was on top of the world. But then it all came crumbling down. And I, I, I tore up my knee. I had to forfeit the title and I missed WrestleMania. But missing WrestleMania made me realize the WrestleMania moments they're not guaranteed, and you can't take that for granted, and that's why I'm out here, Kurt. WrestleMania's right around the corner. I don't have a title, I don't have a Money in the Bank contract to cash in this time. Hell, I don't even have a match at Elimination Chamber. Well, I know I told you last week that would be your last chance to get a tag team title shot, but maybe I was wrong. Why don't we find you another partner? How about that, Kurt? With all due respect, Kurt. He's gonna tap in. Thanks, but no thanks. When you came to Monday Night Raw as a general manager, you told me you wanted to be a, me to be a mainstay of this place. You wanted me to be a big piece of Monday Night Raw. Well, I gotta be honest with you. Right now, I don't want to be a part of Monday Night Raw. I don't want to be a part 
of Monday Night Raw. I want to be Monday Night Raw. I want to turn this place back into Monday Night Rawlings. I want to be the man one more time. I want Brock Lesnar. I want the Universal Championship. And I won it at WrestleMania. But the only way I can do that is if I win the Elimination Chamber match. What do you mean, Kurt? Listen, Seth, I love your enthusiasm. But I can't just cancel tonight's Fatal 4 Way match and give you an opportunity. I can't Look, I, do that. I don't want you to give me an opportunity, Kurt. I want to earn an opportunity just like everybody else, so hear me out. Let's take this second chance Fatal 4-Way match. Let's turn it into a Fatal 5-Way. It just wouldn't be fair to the other four wrestlers, the other four superstars. Listen, don't put me in a bad spot, man. That's not, that's not what I'm trying to do, but my fate is in your hands right now. I come out here every single week, and I put my body on the line for Monday Night Raw. I put my body on the line for you. And look, Jason Jordan missing WrestleMania, that sucks. Missing out on his WrestleMania moment, that sucks. That doesn't mean that I've got to miss out on mine. Well, in all honesty, it's not ultimately up to you. It's not up to me. It's up to them. So I'm going to ask all of you a simple yes or no answer. A question, I should say. Do all of you want me to give Seth an opportunity to make it to the Elimination Chamber? I think you have your spot. You have your opportunity.